Just running charitable events officially kicks off its 2023 campaign tonight. News 13 is proud to partner again this year with the Salvation Army on the empty stocking fund. News 13's Tom Lewis joins us now live from Bill Kramer Chevrolet out there in Panama City off 23rd Street. Tom, what's happening at this hour? Well, Amy, this is our second year for the Empty Stocking Fund, partnering with uh, the Salvation Army and Bill Kramer Chevrolet, and we're getting right into the spirit of this thing. I want to join our general manager, Terry Cole, who's got a special presentation. Terry? Absolutely. I'm Almost getting ready. Uh, no, I'm going to give some money away here in just a second. On behalf of the Next Star Charitable Foundation, here's a check for $10,000 to kick right. off the hey, Red hey. Stocking Fund. Around from the small crowd that's here, still here. <laughs> we had earlier this this uh, afternoon or this evening, we had uh, a lot of the board members here, and uh, a lot of them dropped checks, and we'll get into that in just a bit. Well, let's get into it right now. Uh, a lot of checks got dropped in that little box behind you. Yes, uh, we had the total of uh, $14,150. Yeah, that's fantastic. And then another 10 on top of that. Yes. Yeah. So we've got a good start to the campaign. We're not going to talk about the goal just yet because we want people to get involved with this. Uh, Bill Dozier, you're the chairman of the Salvation Army Board, uh, and this has got to be gratifying for you. Oh, it certainly is gratifying, and we want to say thank you for this check, Channel 13. This is going to go a long ways to helping people throughout our area. Tell me what you've seen from the Empty Stocking Fund and your time involved. Oh, I've seen uh, families helped, uh, needy families that come in that need help, and children at Christmas time, children being being uh, helped at Christmas time. So uh, it's gone a long ways. A lot of good work has come from the Empty Stocking Fund. Oh, fantastic. Uh, Bill Craver joining us here. Bill, you've got a, we got another partner here that we yes, need to talk about, Ace Hardware. Uh, uh, Stephen Smith, Cami Smith, owners of Ace Hardware. Mm -hmm. They're going to round up again this year uh, and make a contribution to match. So that's been a great addition to our campaign, and we certainly do appreciate it. So if you go in Ace and you spend $25.25, and they tell them to round it up, they'll go up $0.75. Cents. All that money adds up, and then they match. And then they match, yes. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, I mentioned the, the way you could contribute. Uh, Ace Hardware is one. If you go shopping at Ace, tell them, sure, go ahead and round up. That'll be great. That'll go to the Empty Stocking Fund. We talked about the green box back here. That'll be set up all the way through the campaign. So if you're driving by Bill Kramer Chevrolet, drop your check in. Come on in. They'll be happy to see you. And then, of course, there's our scan code down at the bottom of the screen here, our uh, QR code. You can scan that, contribute that way. You can go to our website, mypanhandle.com. We'll be giving you lots of ways that you can contribute over the next uh, six to eight weeks leading up to the holidays. Amy? It's a great cause. Thank you, Tom.